Hi, welcome to our lesson for today. We will be looking at systems technology and our lesson focuses on identifying hardware configuration of a computer. Now, we are going to focus on a few hardwares that really need us to understand and know what they are used for. Now, when you plan on buying a computer, it is important that you are able to understand and tell the difference between some general hardware configuration. Now, to understand this, you need to know your computer specifications. And there's a few examples that we're going to look at, which is a CPU, RAM, as well as a hard drive. Now, let's see the first one. Now, the first one is your processor, which is mostly referred to as the CPU. Now, the CPU is the brain of the computer, and it's responsible for running programs and processing data. Now, the CPU is basically measured in gigahertz in terms of the size. Now, let's look at the next hardware. The next hardware is what we call memory. Now, memory stores data and programs temporarily while they are being processed. It also allows the CPU to easily access data and process faster. It comes in form of DIMMs and it is measured in gigabytes. Now the next one is hard drive. Now the hard drive is the main storage of data and programs permanently. Now it simply means that it is totally different from the memory. Remember the memory we said it stores data temporarily. Now the capacity of hard drives would usually be larger and it comes in different sizes. Now these are the three hardwares that we had to look at for this lesson. I hope you enjoyed. We'll see you next time. Goodbye.